welcome to Fight Night Street Fighter Edition, featuring some of the top players from around the world. With $25,000 in prize money on the line, who will go home the Street Fighter champion? This is Fight Night. What's up, guys? I'm Caseless. Welcome to another episode of Fight Night Street Fighter Edition. Now, we have eight badass players for you here this week, some from before, like Infiltration, some new, like Laugh and K-Brad. It's gonna be an epic series, guys. You ready to have some fun? Yeah! All right, now before we go any further, let's see what happened last time. I'm here with Infiltration, our current champion. Are you ready to keep going? Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and hand it off to Mike Ross and Gutex, our commentators. What's up, everybody? Welcome to ESGN Fight Night Street Fighter Edition Round 2. My name is Gutex. And I'm Mike Ross. And last time on Fight Night, we saw some incredible matches, some extremely high-level gameplay, and some surprise results. Uh, I, for one, was very shocked that uh, Tokido made such a killing that he did, only to be stopped by Infiltration. That's right, and now Infiltration's gonna keep going against some of the old faces from last time and some new faces this time. Uh, why don't we talk a little bit about some of the new faces that we have this time, Mike? Sure. So we got Chai Rithi from Canada, K. Brad, Sanford Kelly, and Laugh. These are some of the players that I want to see square off specifically against, you know, the uh, infiltration right now. That's the right. Former Evo champion. That's right. And we also have some old returning faces as well. The current reigning champion of Street Fighter 4, Sien, as well as Ali Yoon and Ryan Hart. I mean, a lot of these guys actually have some history mm -hmm. with Infiltration. You know, they've either beaten them in the past, or they've trained with them, or they've come really, really close to beating them, or they play, you know, Cammy. Yeah. <laughs> which is... Absolutely. I was going to say that, you know, Ali Yoon was mentioning to us earlier that he actually let Infiltration stay with him at uh, one of the previous EVOs. I think it was EVO 2011. Mm -hmm. And he said when they were playing matches, they did fairly well against each other. So I would really like to see them square off again. That's right. Why don't we take a look, a closer look at some of these players. My name is Ali Yoon and I'm from France. My name is Ho Kun Sien. My name, my game attack is Razor Sien, and I'm from Singapore. I'm, my name is Sanford Kelly. I'm from New York City. I represent Empire Arcadia. My name is Ryan, uh, my gamer tag is Laugh, and I'm from South Korea. So my name is Henry Ung, my gamer tag is Charity. I come from Montreal, Canada, and I play for Canada Cup Gaming. My name is Ryan Hall, my handle is Prodigal Sound, and I'm from London, England. Uh, my name is Kenneth Bradley, handle <clears throat> My afternoon is K Brad. I'm from uh, Washington, D.C. Wow, Infiltration's really got his hands full this time. That's right. Um, and in this edition, there's been modified rules, such as character lock is no longer there. So you can switch characters after a loss, and I think that can really help out players such as Ryan Hart, who have more than one character. That's right. You don't want to be a Sagat player fighting Akuma. So let's take a look at the video to learn more about these rules. Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition is a 1v1 cult fighting game developed by Capcom and Dimps. Choosing one of 39 characters, players fight to the finish until their health bars are completely drained. There are two possible ways to attack in Street Fighter, punches, 
and kick. Using these moves with your joystick at the same time activates abilities or combos that can deal significant damage. At the highest level of competitive play, Street Fighter's extremely quick pace not only requires top players to be fast with their hands, but also requires them to take out opponents with mind games. Those who outmaneuver and outthink their opponents will be the champion. So here's the rules for Fight Night Street Fighter. Eight world-class players are chosen at random by the heartless ESGN TV wheel. They are going to battle each other over seven brutal matches until we have the last man standing. But the stakes are high. Players can win from $250 right up to $25,000. My favorite new rule, Mike, is that now you can use the respin defensively. So if you spin and I come up, I can just say, no, 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 I'm gonna use my respin and then I don't have to play you. Absolutely, I think it's just as important to be a master of the wheel as it is a master of the stick. Well, let's take a look at Tasteless and see what Infiltration's gonna do. I'm here with Infiltration, our champion, who is ready to begin his match. Now, Infiltration, you have the option to remove any of the players on the wheel. Are you gonna take that option? All right, pretty confident. Um, now we do have an empty spot right here. You get to pick one of the players and add them. So there'll be a second player um, icon here to fill this hole. Which of the players are you gonna pick? Okay. I want this guy, Sanford. Sanford, you've been chosen. All right, I'm putting Sanford right on here. Sanford, how do you feel, man? You've been picked by Infiltration as the most likely player. Let's uh, go. You want to play against? I'm ready. You ready? Are you confident? All right. Well, let's go ahead and spin the wheel, Infiltration, and see who you're going to get. I believe Infiltration's been practicing on his wheel at home to see if he can get this perfectly. And it is beginning to slow down. There are, again, two Sanfords on there. And we're getting close to it. We're passing Reinhardt now. Chi ready. John. Oh, we might actually get Stanford here. Oh, my God. Oh! oh. Sanford! Uh. All right, it's time. Infiltration, head on over to the seat. Let's get this game going. Um, 선수 하고는 음, 한번 정도 싸워봤던 것 같은데 그때는 사나트라는 캐릭터 썼었고, 예, 직 사가 사가. 지금은 캐릭터 바꾼 걸로 알고 있어요. 최근에 에이펙스라는 대회에서 오니로 우승을 한 걸로 알고 있는데, 그래서 개인적으로 되게 흥미가 생겼어요. 또 오니라는 캐릭터하고 싸워볼 기회도 없고 잘하는 선수가 있었으면 했으니까 저도 약간은 썼던 캐릭터고. 그래서 붙으면 어떨까 되게 좀 싸워보고 싶어요. 어떤 느낌일까. 저도 되고 이거도 되고. 재밌는 게임 하면 되니까 될수 있으면은 초반에 빨리 붙어서 재밌는 게임 해보고 싶습니다. Infiltration is a player that has been around since the Street Fighter 4 era. My interaction with him, my first interaction with him is when I played him at final round of 2013, which was last year. The first thing I thought about Infiltration is he's really tall. <laughs> You know, he's a tall, he's a very tall guy. Myself versus him, I'm very confident. Am I a better player than him? I'm not here to prove that I'm a better player than him. I'm here to beat him. That's why I'm here. Stay tuned for more Fight Night. It's a shame that I'm the best. This wheel will decide their fate. I'm really anxious to see what happens. Street Fighter returns to Fight Night. <laughs> Welcome back to Fight Night. 
Oh my gosh, Mike, can you believe who the wheel has decided to put up against Infiltration first? This is the match that I wanted to see. I think this is the match that you wanted to see, but this is the match that the people need to see. These are the dudes that are here that both want to win more than I think anybody else wants to win anything in the world. Uh, that's right, these guys both had breakfast today, but both of these guys are the hungriest dudes in the room. Absolutely, and the last time you know that we've seen Sanford play was this guy just went on a tear at Apex 2014 with his Oni. He kind of did away with Sagat towards the end of the tournament. He said, you know what? I'm going to go with what my heart is telling me. My heart is telling me that my Oni is ridiculous yeah. right now. Will he play Oni against Infiltration, you think? I think he's going to play Oni against Infiltration. Oh, and, you know, from, from when, when we talked about, when we talked to Infiltration earlier, mm -hmm. he said that he wanted to fight his Oni. That's and a lot of people say, you know, like I think even K-Brad mentioned that Sanford is at this kind of turning point where he wants to go the Oni route, but his Sagat is kind of, you know, mm -hmm. taking a back seat a little bit. So it'll be interesting to see who he uses. I mean, I think we can all agree that Sagat versus Akuma is not a good match. So we'll see if Sagat's Oni has got what it takes to beat last year's Street Fighter 4 world champion. Well, let's go to Tasteless and find out more from the players. Yeah. And I'm back here with the players on the couch. Guys, what are you thinking about this match? Well, I'm kind of pissed off. You're pissed? Why? Yeah. Did you see the spin? It was like almost there to body infiltration again. That is true. You almost ended up playing infiltration. But don't worry, Sanford's going to body him. It's going to be like 7-3, seven, 7-4. Seven, this is about to be free. Don't worry about it. All right, Lap, what are you thinking about this match? <laughs> well, they both are probably going to play demon characters, and they're very similar, so it's very hard to call. Okay, so it's up in the air with you. Sean, what are you thinking, man? Infiltration takes it, I think. What score? I don't know. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> Infiltration might take it. Score, I don't know. Aliyun, your thoughts going into this? Who's going to take this? Uh, I think Infiltration is going to be a hard match for, for Oni. It's going to be a hard match for yeah. Oni? Ryan Hart, do you agree? I think it's going to be hard for Oni, but I think it's going to be very close. I don't know, 7-5, seven, 7-6 seven, to either one of them. Is this harder for Oni or is this harder for Stanford in this situation? Is it more of a character or more of a player issue? Um, that would depend on how much Akuma experience Stanford had in this particular matchup, but just going on the characters, I think Oni has a difficult time with uh, Akuma as well because of the sweep. Because of the sweep and um, just how fast uh, Akuma can uh, move around the screen. All right, and your thoughts on the score? Uh, the score, I think it'll be more on the infiltration side, but uh, it's a matchup we don't see often if they pick Akuma against Oni. All right, well, we've heard it from our players. They're saying that this is an infiltration win here. We're going to see if that's going to be the case. Infiltration, are you ready? Uh, I'm ready. He's ready. Sanford, you ready to do this? Yeah. Yeah. Gentlemen, let's start the game. All right, man, here we go. This is going to be the match of matches. I can't believe we're getting into this right away. What an amazing start <laughs> to round two of Fight Night. Let's get into it. All right. Here we go. <laughs> this is what Infiltration wanted. I think that Infiltration is more scared of Sanford's Sagat than he is of his owning. I would have to agree because he knows that, you know, Sanford hasn't been apparently using Oni as for as long as he's been using Sagat. Right. <clears throat> But you know, he, you know, <laughs> Sanford proved at Apex 2014 in New Jersey that his Oni is no slouch. Ooh, Here we go, Ooh, Sanford gets the first crumble. Oh, oh no, drops, drops his combo, combo. That's man. Not good. That that could definitely come back to bite him. But he still does have this life lead. Oh man, he's you know, actually playing this matchup very well right now. Yeah, and for those of you guys that are unfamiliar with Oni, he actually has all command normals, so he can hit. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh wow, and he's already oh, he's dizzy. Dizzy? That was. In one wow. simple exchange, he already got dizzy. See, the thing is, Mike, he had one chance, mm. and he dropped that combo. That's right. You can't be dropping combos against the world champion. Mm -hmm. But hey, you know, Sanford is a world champion himself. That is true. Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Evo 2009. Yeah, Evo 2009. He knows what it takes to win. All these people on this panel know what it takes to win. <clears throat> Big damage right yeah. here. Gets the hard knockdown. Good okay. blocks by Sanford. <laughs> oh man, Sanford is just getting 
unlucky with the vortexing right now, and infiltration seals that off really quick on that first game. Uh, Sam Sanford not looking pleased with his performance right there. No, he's not. He, <laughs> that's not the way that you want to take your first loss mm -hmm. in in a set. You that's know, right. you want to just shake it off and be like, all right, that's cool. You got me infiltration. That's yeah. fine. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm here at the couch with Laugh right now. Now, Laugh, you, Infiltration, both being Koreans. Uh, in the Korean scene, how often do we uh, do we see Oni players? Not a whole lot, but we do have a few players that play Oni at a pretty good level. So the matchup knowledge would be in Koreans' favor in this situation, I would say. Okay, so you're saying that, you know, in the Korean scene, there's definitely enough solid Onis that uh, Infiltration go in this with a solid game plan? I would think so, especially since um, Infiltration plays Oni himself. So the knowledge deficit that Sanford has to play with is uh, quite sizable, I would say. Awesome, thanks for the input. You know, one thing that Oni does have uh, over Akuma is that blue fireball just seems, yeah. you know, Aku Akuma's not gonna be throwing too many red fireballs. Right. Three hit red fireballs, fireballs from that far away, so Oni can sit back and use his blue fireball to just tear through it. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh, nice EX doing cross flip for the uh, cross up. Oh my empty god. Empty jump low. Oh, empty jump throw. Goodness gracious. It's going to be a perfect right here. Oh, he drops a combo. All right. Here's Sanford. Oh, no. oh he's, he's nervous. I yeah, think he's, he's nervous. I don't know. I don't know what it is right now, but this is not the same Sanford Kelly that we saw mm -mm. Uh, you know, a few weeks ago. Mm -mm. It's done. No, you gotta relax. It, it is gotta way relax. too early in the set. Mike, we don't know relax. what's gonna happen. Well, that is Sanford's gotta relax. That's for sure. See, look at it. Yeah, infiltration yeah. is powered up. That's right. He looks focused. My goodness. Do you think I? I you think maybe Sanford should try Sagat if this game doesn't work out? He's got to try something. Oh, no, you no, know, the thing keys. is, Sanford is the master of a lot. Of, well, he's he's got a lot of pocket characters. You yeah. know, I've seen him play Viper. Yeah, I've seen him play Cammy. Yeah, you know, Sanford is he's got so much experience, mm -hmm. so much, ex uh, so much experience in high pressure situations, mm -hmm. man. But I think his only his only might just be not there yet. It's just well, I mean, then again, you know, he is going against the you know, world. One of the, yeah, one of the greatest <laughs> Akuma players on the galaxy. Yes. <laughs> We've explored all the planets, yeah, all the exactly. solar systems. And, and the results uh, survey said that infiltration was up there. <laughs> <laughs> all right, see, there we go. Now, Sanford is, it looks like Sanford is now regrouped mentally, and now he's mm, back in the zone. Okay. Oh, wow. But, uh, you know, I, I definitely think that one of the contributing factors to uh, Sanford not being able to focus mentally yeah. is having to hear all yes. the players just doubt him right before yeah. the match, letting him know it's like I, you know, the, there was no faith in the boy. Right. You had faith in your boy, Mike. Always. <laughs> they didn't ask us. Oh, there thought. it is. Ooh, okay. there we go. Okay. See. Oh, this is. Oh my. Sanford Kelly. Oh, caught him with Sanford. his throws. There right, he is. Right, okay. There he Sanford Kelly. He he is awake now. He is. He's working. Up. And you he's know? Told him. He's telling himself that right now too. He said, "I'm here. I'm ready. That's right. That's yeah. right. That's what I got to do." See, Sanford. Slapper was the last one to the studio today. That Mike is Ross. right. I'm and gonna let's assume... hope he's not the first one out. <laughs> <laughs> he, uh, I think, had to uh, wipe the uh, the eye boogers out. That's right. <laughs> Ooh, okay, look at that. Now he's playing the zoning game correctly. Ooh, he's got his offense. Oh, oh my goodness. Ooh. Oh, okay, now he's wiping his hands down. He's feeling himself. There we go. But the infiltration is not phased. You can tell a lot from the bottom.